Hey guys, Mark Conley with Daily Soccer Skills, and today we're continuing on our speed, agility, and quickness training. Uh, we also have some endurance and uh, core strength training um, components as well. So quick uh, word about this exercise. You want to set yourself up a diamond with all the cones being 10 yards apart from each other, including the center cone. So the first set, um, you sprint into that center cone. You're going to shuffle to the right. You'll sprint two cones across the grid, back it, sprint back into the center, back pedal to your starting position, and then you'll sprint um, all the way through the, uh, the cones and give yourself about a 15 second rest before going again. Um, do about five on each side, five where you're shuffling to the left and five where you're shuffling to the right. Um, if you need a little bit extra time, great, but always, you know, we're trying to build endurance and, and think quality over quantity here. Next, we go into sprints with jumps. So quick point here, as you head into that center cone, it's three jumps, you'll shuffle, you'll sprint to the right, it's three side jumps there. You'll sprint across the grid, three side jumps there. As you come back in, it's um, three jumps, but now they're going front to back, so it works a different muscle group, and you'll back pedal again, three jumps front to back, and you'll sprint through. This will take you about 30 seconds to get through each one, so um, don't be surprised if you get a little bit tired in between these. Give yourself about 20 seconds and try to see if you can do anywhere between five and 10 um, five and ten repetitions here. Next step is our endurance phase. This kind of brings in a little bit of in interval training. Um, so you'll set the cones at 10 and 20 yards. You'll sprint to the first set of cones at 10, back pedal, sprint to 20, and then you jog back. That's your little rest there. So sprint to 10, back pedal, um, sprint to 20, jog back, and that's your rest. Try to do a set of, um, of 10 of these. Our final phase is we head into our core strength, and here we're doing planks. Um, so think elbows and toes, iron cross, uh, planks. The way it works is elbows and toes are touching the ground back straight. You're going to hold the plank position for 30 seconds. Then you'll uh, shift on your side, and you'll go 30 seconds on the side. You'll go to the opposite side, 30 seconds on that side, and then back to the center for plank push-ups for uh, 30 seconds. Uh, you want to do about five sets of these, and it works to isolate those, those core muscles, so it really starts to build some strength there in that middle area. All right, guys, this should be about a 25-minute workout for you. Get out there and train.